that I fully intend to win this election. 13 hours after addressing a nationally televised audience at St. Anselm College, presidential candidate Kamala Harris pulled no punches at Keene State. We need a new commander in chief. Harris promising if elected, she would take executive actions to confront gun violence if Congress fails to pass comprehensive gun safety legislation in her first 100 days. The people in the United States Congress have not had the courage to act. And so somebody's got to have the courage to do something about it and be willing to take the political consequences, but do it because it's the right thing to do. After announcing her bid for the 2020 race, Harris boasted about the importance that New Hampshire would play. But since her first visit, two months have passed. Well, today, she doubled down on her commitment to the Granite State. It is very important to me to be president of New Hampshire, to be accountable to the people of New Hampshire, and to put the resources into it, which is what we've been doing and building up our team here. Harris's words striking a chord with those in attendance, <laughs> including 12-year-old Sadie Bell, who admires Harris and couldn't resist meeting the presidential candidate. It was crazy. I wasn't expecting it because I was in the other room, but I was like, why not try? So I ended up meeting her. Harris wrapped up her Granite State Town Hall tour with a stop in Dartmouth. In Keene, Mike Cherry, WMUR News 9.